client's vehicle was taken. They are refusing to turn over my, my client's vehicle. They are imposing a hundreds and hundreds of dollars of fees. He argues that violates the California Vehicle Code. The law says that if you have an agent here, my client's brother, to retrieve the vehicle, a licensed driver, then the city has to give, give that person who's a registered owner their property. Because simply because you're unlicensed doesn't mean you can't sell the vehicle. You can't have someone else who's licensed use it. He believes his client is part of a larger class, getting vehicles unfairly impounded. This street vendor activist agrees. So I actually witnessed that. Um, a couple weeks ago in Santa Monica. He claims street vendors are easy targets for authorities. Obviously, they know that, you know, they're, they don't have a license because of their, uh, they are undocumented and they're taking advantage of that fact. The lawsuit accuses the city of engaging in violations of the Fourth and Fifth Amendment by depriving unlicensed drivers of their vehicles, imposing a 30-day impound fee, also alleging civil rights violations, targeting directly or indirectly black or brown people, as well as people of low means. When Contreras' client does get his car back. The grand total would be over $2,000 once my client retrieves his vehicle. For someone of low means, for the average person, that is an astronomical amount, especially for a street vendor. So, Lauren, we understand you reached out to the city. Did they have any comment? Yeah, we do, Chair. First, I do want to mention that Contreras' client, the man at the center of this lawsuit, he was not available today to speak with us. Now, the city of Santa Monica, just a short time ago, getting back to me, telling me that they've just received this information and need time to evaluate thoroughly to provide an accurate response. With so this time, they can't provide more information or a position. They are just getting word of this all. So we will keep you updated. For now, that's the latest live in Santa Monica. I'll send it back to you.